And let's check it right here, right now. Right click. Come on, come on, or what? Oh, let me change the day. There we go. I got to all day. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> right, so that's working fine. That's working fine. I'll go ahead and that. Turn that shit all the way down. Nope, didn't turn it all the way down. Fuck, I need to turn it up. Fuck, I'm out of breath already. Right, uh, let's close this shit, I think. Sleep. So I'm doing that thing now in the beginning where I um, sort out just the thumbnails, so the thumbnails are always correct as soon as the live stream goes up. So just. <laughs> it gives me a bit better next time I see the live stream. It's the corresponding freaking game that's on it. Um, so yeah. This is the Assassin's Creed Origins live stream. Um, for anybody that watches the beginning of these things. Thanks very much for watching. Um, if you like it, hit the like button. If you don't, don't hit the dislike button because that would be painful. Um, if you like these, please subscribe. I usually put like a little indication of when these are up on Facebook or Twitter, but... I'm not going to do it today because it couldn't be ours, but I think it might be better if I just uh, leave it so that people who actually subscribe get the notifications and then they can watch the live stream, you know. Uh, but then again, a lot of brief stays on YouTube all the time, sadly. Um, so I thought I'd start off with a little uh, leap of faith, as, as, as always, you know, it's iconic in Assassin's Creed. But I thought maybe I would also recap some of the story so far and basically i didn't i wanted to live stream i said in like the unboxing video which i'll hopefully remember to put a link in the description for people to check that out um <clears throat> i said i was gonna uh live stream right away but i'm glad i didn't because i just wanted to play this i think it was from thursday a few hours every day till now just to enjoy the game so <clears throat> basically start off over here in siwa which is uh by X which is your character's hometown. Hang on there. Got myself a cup of tea here, and I've got the wee collector's edition. Let me see for people who want to have a wee lucky loo. That's him right there. So this is like the god that they worship in Siwa. Like, well, this is like their god. You know, they worship all the gods in Egypt, but this is like their town god. So that's him. And I was wondering, like, at the beginning, he has, like, this big beard and a load of dreadlocks, and that's obviously not the way this character looks. Oops. In the uh, collection, but obviously he shaved it now. Uh, goes to the story. And the awesome thing about this is, is that it's very different from some of the other games. I'm just going to do, like, a miniature review, sort of, uh, to get you all up to speed. Is that I think it's a lot more like, um... Destiny, like you see here, in relation to the, uh, upgrades... For your weapons and things like that and your gear down here at the bottom which i like um means there's all sorts of different types of combat you can get into um and the combat itself is very different if you've watched any of the videos you'll notice that um it's not just hold your guard button so you can't die and then like attack or counter you actually have to have your wits about you and um try and actually fight properly in proper combat and people can sneak up on you and things like that the recon that you can do with your bird Sinu, so you hear, like this, is very reminiscent of um, Ghost Recon, and it's, it works really well in here. So basically, you fly around. You can see here, obviously, the uh, these are all sorts of animals. These are like crocodiles and hippos, and these are there's wood and like iron ore. 
these like little transports that the enemy have and you can like uh, rob them to help craft things uh, but all to see this is like different types so there's like soft um, this represents like soft crafting material this represents like a harder crafting material um, so this could be like a hippo and this could be like a crocodile and this could be like a bird and that could be like a deer you won't know until you actually go over there but it doesn't really make a difference um what else yes you can go in the boats the underwater areas are very reminiscent to uh, black flag so you do have a lot of um of the, the great great sides of assassin's creed in the old days coming into this game which makes it amazing and this is probably the best game i've played uh, all year and then i would say battlefield one but like those two are top tier games you know regardless um but this is an amazing game as you can see here there's a wee uh crocodile larry's way hunting and you can have them running in and around ais and things like that and civilians and you have to like help them or if you don't want to you don't have to and they have different ranks themselves so he's probably yeah as you can see he's, he's going to attack these bad guys over here because they killed his man but yeah as you can see here you can fly here um as, as a form of recon so if i said i wanted to go over there to where that tree is i now can come out because i've flown too far away it takes to a minute and then there's the tree i can figure out where to go but other than that if you want to actually like properly recon there you hold hover and you can search around like this and if you're in an area that you haven't been to before like if there's a loot or uh, an, a, a target to hit you basically hover and like this actually makes it better the wee circle will have like another circle around it and it'll sort of indicate to you similar to the way you would unlock something in um uncharted or ghost recon itself as to where the uh the, the thing you're looking for is and then it gets highlighted and then you can find out where it is i'll show you that maybe here actually this is like a new location hopefully i can actually check it out without actually being near it so there you go see the little circle so that's it tells me there's something of interest nearby so as i go up there's the arrow at the bottom you look around sort of like finding the, the key but obviously this is a loot area so this could be a weapon a shield or just a lot of money and on certain occasions this may not be a looting location it could be um what would it be it could be a uh, an animal like a, a king animal, so likes of crocodiles there, you might have one of the biggest crocodiles of that area. And oh, there you go, I've actually discovered a new region just by using the bird. So, as you can see here, let's see if I go over to this one. Yeah, so as you can see here, there's a little location. So there's a crocodile there, there's a shitload of crocodiles, and there's one huge big fucking crocodile. Uh, this area was a hyena there. You get like a loot location here, that's just treasure. Um, Here's like little light posts where you have to kill a captain, you can kill like a lieutenant as well, depending on the, the scale of the hideouts. Um, and then there's like loot treasures as well. Now the interesting thing about this is that there's a lot of replay value and it's not just thrown in there for the sake of trying to make you replay it. For example, over here in Siwa, there's one location right here. Uh, no, sorry. This one. That was in the loot areas. And I wanted to completely sort this place out before i moved on but i couldn't because the guys here are so powerful guarding this loot that i can't actually kill them now i could try and run in and quickly loot it and get out but they're very powerful like two arrows and i'm dead and it doesn't actually show you um what rank they are so i don't know how far i have to go until i can just defeat them and i think there's, er there's there are people like that in every single area and as you can see the map is massive you know so you go from siwa to alexandria here actually you go basically to Lake uh, Mariottis or whatever this is and you have to like travel all the way up here into Alexandria to see your wife and the story continues and whatever there's loads of different little regions and recently this is going to be a spoiler if anybody wants to um if anybody doesn't want to listen to it so I'll basically put my hand up here when I'm done uh the pharaoh is trying to get rid of the Medjay um or is being made to get rid of the, the Medjay who are like the pharaoh's personal bodyguards and things like that by the secret order and we don't know if they're the templars yet but most likely could evolve to become the templars but they're called um hopefully it'll show me here i guess like the the secret society or something like that they call them and originally these these guys here at the bottom 
all had different names, but these are now their, what we know them as. Um, and when I say names, I mean animal representations. So they have these masks on them. And this guy here, we thought was the snake. And we thought he was the guy that killed our, our son. And uh, all these other guys were sort of in the beginning, um, where was it, in Siwa. But now we've recently come into contact with Cleopatra and the guy that we could be this guy who starts the Assassin's Creed or maybe that's gonna happen at the end, we don't know. And he's hinted into the fact that there's these next guys, the lizard, the crocodile, the hyena and the scarab. And he sort of shows you what they're doing to the um, society in Egypt at the moment. So as you can see, they're not completely in the middle of the screen. So obviously that's gonna go even further until there's like one final guy to be, uh, to be killed. And from the little sort of story that gets told by these four guys, the hyena, the crocodile, the lizard, and the scarab, you can tell that they actually have some sort of uh, power within them, or they're using some sort of a mystical power that relates to the orb. And they want to use it to unlock this vault that um, we were guarding at the beginning. Um, and all these little guys that were dead, uh, Dunamun and I think the hippo guy, uh, Idoris, they all actually had some sort of a mystical power that they were using against you. Not in combat though, however, but uh, it was um, it was just like in a cutscene whenever you'd kill them. Hey Alana, how's it going? Thanks very much for, for joining. Um, that's basically all the spoilers, if anybody was waiting for the spoilers not to, to come back now. Um, and there's obviously your craft and things, you can do that in Destiny 2 as well. Um, you can upgrade each of these if you want, but I don't think there's any point in upgrading them because I loot so much and every time I loot they just get even even more uh, gear that's already going to be stronger anyway so there's no point in me p choosing a piece of gear upgrading it to like you know upgrading the shit out of it and then having to like get rid of it because I loot an even more powerful weapon or shield or whatever but I like to keep some of them here as you can see that's a pretty cool little blade and these two here are ones that you get in the beginning um, the gold ones here are the ones that I got with the uh, the god edition. They're not very powerful, but as you can see, they've got little special abilities here, like a poison hit and things like that. Might upgrade that, um, but I'm not sure. Maybe. Because that would be pretty cool to just get like a poison hit whenever you kill somebody. Because some of these guys can be really difficult to defeat. There's all the different uh, missions. Um, let me see. Bex Promise. That's like a big mission that goes all throughout the, the game. It's like... Uh, secret locations things like that so is the taste of her thing a lot of xp is to do with like a murder thing that you keep coming across now i don't know if certain things that i've found are being checked off but um that is a very long ass mission and i think i'm fine in different locations but it's not telling me which is a wee bit frustrating but you know fuck it um and here's all the other little missions the hyena the the lizard and whatever and you can see the crocodile is going to be very difficult because he's level 25 um i'm good thanks for asking that's good um do you play this much or have you played um assassin's creed or are you interested in it let's see what we can do here now get out of this we'll go do some missions it's possible i've just been sort of doing the side missions to uh you don't rank up quick enough just doing the story missions you know oh and this little fucker right here Oh, he's level 22, so maybe I could kill him. That'd be good. He first arrived whenever he was maybe about level 16. Uh, and they are deadly. These are, um... These are bounty hunters, and they basically arrived after you killed the final guy, you know, in those first, those first rows that I had. And every time they're in your vicinity, you hear this big sort of horn. But uh, they're basically... Yeah, that, that, that horn there. They, they're basically, um... They're sent out to try and kill you. And, so, and the cool thing about this map as well is it's actually in 3D, you see. So you see there, you can see like the side of the, the tower there. So, uh, oh fuck, there's another one, there's loads of them. He's level 20, I should maybe try and kill more of these guys. Probably get a lot of XP. Um, and here, these little squares are photographs that people take. And the funny thing is, it's like, oh, one of the Superman, he is in my friends list. Um... So they put them up, but I don't know if anybody can see mine, but there's a lot of pictures here from people I've never even met or come across, but they must be my friends in this. And you can basically take a picture and you can share it and people can like it and whatever. As you can see, there's like 1,242 uh, likes on that one. And these little question mark locations, they can be um, 
the introduction to a new area like um, like this it can just be something like that or like a new region and uh, there can be loot locations um, what do you call it outposts and things like that and um, yeah I think that's it basically a quick introduction um, and there's a shitload of these freaking uh, sync locations so you can't really get to them as quickly as you used to in the other games because it's so big Alana has played the demo of it and and it seemed cool. I might buy it one day. What are you streaming with? Uh, streaming basically through the PlayStation. Um, hopefully I'll get the Elgato maybe around Christmas time. I was going to get it myself, but you know, the missus is looking for something to buy me and I got one of these things I can tell her to buy me. So it's like 160, 180 quid. Um, so hopefully I get that, but knowing me, I'll get it and I'll probably never know how to freaking use it properly, so there's probably no point in me getting it. Um, but this works for this so far, you know. There is a bit of a delay, I think there's maybe like a 30 second delay on this. I'll show you what it's like to fight these dudes. And this is my mount. He's called Fangs. You get him as part of the uh, the Gods edition. It's like a snake edition thing. So you can hold this to power up your bow a bit and go for a headshot. And that'll take out more of them. Or take out more... Boom, right in the mouth. I can take out more of your... Uh, take off more uh, health from... Fuck me, I sound like I'm a retard right now when I'm talking. And then you go and loot him. You get his hard leather. And you actually get one of your arrows back. Um, what else was there? Yeah, so one thing I'll show you is that, um, pretty cool. With your gear, with the likes of your, um, your bow and arrows, you can get ones that are sort of similar to, uh, modern day weapons as a way to sort of try to, um, rank it. So, I don't actually have any because I just keep, uh, dismantling them for the, for the goods that you get. But you can get one that's just simply like an assault rifle, a hunter bow, or like uh, a light bow here. You can get one that's similar to a sniper rifle. You can't charge up that uh, that shot, but you can aim at the head and get a guaranteed one shot kill. And you get ones that are similar to like machine guns, which will shoot a shitload of bows at the same time. Uh, or sorry, arrows at the same time, I should say. And then you get the likes of your melee weapons, which range from swords to sickle swords, heavy blunt objects and heavy blades. and each of these, whenever you're using your R1 quick attack or your R2 heavy attack, have different sort of combat sequences that, uh, you know, kill people. Like, for example, with the spears that you get, you can, like, kill a guy, put a straight through him into the ground, and then you use your shield to, like, kick him off it. It's unreal. It's really cool. I got the OBS to stream. Yeah, OBS is really good to stream. Uh, apparently, it's, like, the go-to... Uh, software for people that use Twitch and things like that, which is what I use for my computer. So if you look at the likes of my um, my Watch Dogs 2 stream that I had recently, and any other streams like PUBG, I think that's basically it. That's what I'm basically using. Um, and I've got like a Blue Yeti mic and things like that from a microphone. So hopefully when I sort that out, uh, I'll be using that. Oh fuck, I forgot to go and get this loot here and see what this is about. OBS is apparently the best, but I, I find it much easier to use that X Studios one. What games do you like to uh, stream with? I think if I remember your channel correctly, I think it's Roblox you're doing. I keep seeing Roblox pop up. Uh, oh, and one other thing you can do as well is um, if you hold up, it sort of does this little. Uh, blast and it sort of highlights the loot areas for you or things of interest but the little triangles the upside down triangles can be very hard to see in bright light Patrick what's going on dude don't forget there's a delay man there's a big fucking hammer nice one you can swim for quite a while under here as well and they, they did go into a lot of detail here. As you can see, this is a sunken ship. But as you can see as well, there's uh, shitloads of arrows that sort of tell you a story as to what happened with this uh, ship. Oh, there's another loot box. We've got a better arrow, or a bone arrow there. Better hurry. Oh, shit. 
I should be getting a blue snowball mic. Yeah, every time you go underwater, a guy with a boat will always come nearby in case you need to get out of dodge really quickly. Um, it's cheaper than the Blue Yeti. I haven't streamed yet. When I get to 1,000 subs, then I will. Okay, so you obviously make videos then, and then you're gonna start streaming. It's post Minecraft and Sims, not much Roblox, but I still, but I still have to post some of the Roblox videos. Cool, well, that's good. So yeah, if you're ever stuck in the water, these uh, the guys and folks will come to your aid. And you can just you can just go around like normal, just move like you would in a horse. But I didn't realize there's actually a boost button, and that can actually get you from A to B much much quicker. Uh, not much, Patrick. Just doing this live stream, like I said, it was trying to make more content and shit like that for the channel. But I never got enough freaking time. Had to fix my car last weekend. Got the radiator sorted, which is good. Thank God. Where we're going now, let's see. Uh, we'll go to this location, get this one sorted. Actually, we'll go here and then we'll go there. Yeah. That's what I'm trying to do. I'll try and complete things on the way so you know I'm not farting about as much. You know, backtracking and things like that. It is an awesome game and you should definitely pick it up if you can. Uh, it looks like there's going to be good DLC coming out as well for it. You should do... Yeah, I know. A guy had said that as well in one of my last posts, and it is something... Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. So you see, it's 25 XP just for locating an area. Um, but I want to wait till I've got things in my man cave uh, upgraded a wee bit more before I do a gaming setup video. Because I want to sort of show off the man cave as well. Lion. There it is. Oh, it's a secret door. Yeah. You always have to use secret doors, but they do lead to a lot of uh, like loot areas. You know, money-wise, coin. Has you got coin? Sadly, these fuckers wake up as soon as you kill one of them. So what I might do is, I might try and poison this guy. Change your gear wear. Uh, let's upgrade this stuff first. So that's 45. I don't really like the swords, I prefer the sickle to them. Uh, boom. That's what I will do. My setup isn't that good yet, but hopefully after Christmas then it should be upgraded. You know, do a wee video to begin with so you can show like before and after if you wanted, you know? people and see how, how much it's changed because that'll be an excuse to make some content too you know well done on the number of subscribers you've got as well you know if you're if you're close to a thousand that's pretty good it's really good actually okay so there's this, this one here is similar to the uh, predator bow is the long range precision so it's sort of like your sniper rifle bow and then as soon as I do that I just just dismantle it Get the, get the goods. So as you can see, a headshot will not kill him right away, so I'm not going to kill him right now. I'm going to try Freedom Cry and see how good it is. If it's real good, I'll buy this knee as well. Okay, knee, I'll buy this knee as well. Freedom Cry, never heard of that. You can get this dude. Headshot! I might have asked me for uh, editing app so it would improve my videos. Thank you. I'm not that close to a thousand, but it's my main goal. If I go. Okay, fair play. Sun and all the rest of it. See, it's getting lighter now, so they're all waking it up. And you can actually hold down on the, the, the center pad to make time pass by if you want, because certain missions are, uh, are time related. Hang on. Oh shit. Fuck it. Hey. Oh fuck. Game us up away. Oh well. Here's some serious combat. He's dead. Ah oh, fuck. Oh, this is uh, like the machine gun one. Oh, let's see. Hurry up. 
So while you're shooting those, you can sort of move to try and get a headshot. These guys can be deadly. Oh, oh yeah, see, he's very deadly. Sneaky. See, I've got at the bottom of the screen there a little build-up of adrenaline. So I'm going to try and use it now. Yellow's adrenaline and blue is like a killing strike. So if it was blue and I hit it, it would immediately kill him uh, instantly for me, but like in a big attack formation. Um, Alana, I think your channel has potential. I think you will get a lot of subs. It takes a lot of time to get big. Some YouTubers, it's taken them... I presume you're probably saying a long time there. Um, what difficulty is this? Medium difficulty, dude. And it is very hard in certain occasions. Oh, fuck you. Why does it keep laughing like that? I'm ahead R2. Yeah, his his skull is crushed. Yeah, giving him flamingos. <laughs> Ooh. Loads of hyenas in there. Yeah, it's got potential. I mean, back in the early days when I started this, it was like, I want to be a successful YouTuber and whatnot. But now I don't really care. I just want to make videos and put them up. But if people see it, they see it. If people don't, they don't. If people like it, it's great. If they don't, they don't. And I don't really give a shit. I'm doing it for the fun of it now. A little bit of crack after all. You know, you shouldn't try and, like, become fake. Because then it ends up being something you don't want to do. Okay. Why is he there? You go. Look, what is that? He's, he's like throwing him like that for some reason. Move, 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 move. Wow. Hammer sucks. Change weapon. Hammer was really weird to use. Got loads of stuff to loot in here. At 11,000 views, you can set up ads on your videos to start getting paid you need to make 60 pounds then the more you make will be transferred in i thought it was like 6000 views on your entire channel or maybe it, maybe it's 11000 views on your channel altogether Yeah, you're right, Patrick, and that's what I prefer. I don't know if I said it in my Watch Dogs um, live stream, but that's one thing I said. I would, I would prefer just to have a thousand subscribers for the rest of my life, or the rest of the time I'm on YouTube that are like a good little community, than have like a hundred thousand uh, fake subscribers, you know? Which, let's, let's admit, a lot of the YouTubers out there do have fake subscribers. I'm telling you right now, they have to have fake subscribers. I'm looking at you, PewDiePie. <laughs> yeah, PewDiePie's gonna be worried about me saying that, you know. <laughs> okay, let me just switch drinks here. We're going from a cup of tea to some Hot House 13. And one of the good things about streaming and being a YouTuber is as well is that, I'm not saying I'm gonna get promoted by these guys, but you know, you can get sponsored as well if you don't make enough money uh, from your YouTube channel. With the 
pack. The pack you brought. Whoa. What do you mean with the pack? You mean, well, I got this game with the Gods Edition. It came a week late, and I think. Oh shit. And I think they actually, uh. refunded me the, uh. what do you call it? The pack, the. Oh, the shipping. Yeah, the shipping. Because it took so long. Yeah, you can probably get sponsored probably by like a, a media channel, you know, the controls YouTube channels. But outside of it, if you'd say to like a company here, I've got this many views every day, so like, you know, sponsor me, you can do whatever you want. You don't have to have a thousand subs. If you had a hundred subs and you get like a million views in the video, you'll get, you'll get subscribed. Yeah, you'll get sponsored, no problem. Right. Ah, uh, here we go, right. Here's the, the R1, R2, what do you see? Boom. <laughs> I love it. So yeah, I never even actually thought that there would be any guys here. You could review a mobile app and that company could pay you. Yeah, well that's what I mean. But it would be up to you to actually go and ask them and make the deal, you know. If what a lot of YouTubers do is, well, what a lot of companies do is they say, uh, "Hey, yo, you, you're a good YouTuber. Um, you got a good few subscribers. You're getting good views. We'll represent you." And then they take your money and they'll give you like a wage based on what you you earn. Um, and then they will get you. Uh, they will get you your. Um, your sponsorships for you and the shitty thing is, is that they may not be sponsorships that you'll completely agree with these are either you know it'll be like for products that are shitty you know or made in certain ways or by certain people that you don't like you know go i can't remember what the freaking website's called but you can actually take a youtuber's uh url and you can put it into this like uh website and it'll tell you what third party company actually runs them and who else that third party company runs as well. I've been given free drones and stuff, yeah. But then again, I don't want to fucking review stuff that's crap, you know what I mean? If, I, am I, if I'm interested in something, I'll review it because I want to actually get it. And what I would prefer to do is, if I, was, if I liked something, I would buy it myself. And then if someone gave me, or a company gave me it for free, I would give that to like a, a viewer or something like that, you know? Because that's the best thing to do. Because if you're making a hell of a lot of money, like say PewDiePie, press down on the arrow button to call your wee uh, mouth over if you want. And then you can jump onto them. Um, if you made so much money like PewDiePie, I would be giving away a hell of a lot more than what I presume he is giving away. Because I don't see him doing very many giveaways every now and again. But, uh... You know, you should always give back to the community, try and help everybody else out. But this game is great, and if you're not somebody who likes the old Assassin's Creed games, I I did share away from them myself. Oh, hello. Holy fuck. Right. This could be difficult. This is the first time I've come across one of these players. Could be easy if I just stay on my horse though, but these guys are likely to knock me off my horse pretty quickly. Here we go. Ah, fuck the thing. That wee step up knocked me off. He's level 20, he's getting for level with me. So this is really difficult. Thing. Whoa, dude, you're you're healing yourself. Come on, come on. Come on. 
There we go. Fuck. Can't take these guys out now with the... And that's that. Boom. Yeah, I wouldn't want to review something bad. If I was, uh, if I was 600,000 subs or close to that and I got sent a free game to review, I would give it, yeah, you probably give it away. That's a good idea. But the crappy thing is, uh, with the likes of, um, someone like Philip DeFranco, if you've ever watched his stuff, he like has giveaways in every single video. Um, and I'm not, calling them uh, a liar and then they got there but when you do so many competitions like that I wouldn't even enter it because I presume that it's not gonna I'm not gonna win or that nobody wins it at all you know oh shit who the fuck who the hell killed that guy and that lion is this all there is you've got to be kidding me Oh, well, at least we killed that and we got all the, uh, the skins. Whew. Right, we'll maybe do a mission here. Or we'll go up this way. Oh, there's a head location there. See what my gear's like. Although some of the weapons you have are like low in uh, quality, um, they do have like little perks like rate of fire and things like that. So if you did want to upgrade it, it could be pretty, uh, pretty good weapon. I have two ability points, but I want to save them to get three, so that I can, um, I can upgrade like other perks, bigger perks. Because as you see here, in the middle, uh, when you're close to like when you're further in the middle it's like one ability point per perk so where is it? this one here is uh that's two so all these here ones here were one and as you get further and further to hunter and warrior and seer it gets to a point where it's like three or four let me see what's this one acquired for one. Oh well that's probably after you've done all that stuff see these are two you can actually tame lions and stuff like that but i just killed that white one so i'm not getting him uh, Health or attack? I think I'll go for my attack. And that one. Okay, I'll bring another one. I'll bring it. There we go. Getting closer. And you see the wee indicators on the right hand side, these little uh, dots that shows you how far you have to go until you've got like the maximum level of it. I've got the maximum of the arrows, or the quiver as it's called, um, and I'm basically halfway with everything else. So I'm not doing too bad. Let's see, go up there. What, what, what uh, quests have we got here? Some side missions. Physique's promise is too long to even complete. Secrets of the first pyramids. I don't want to go to the pyramids just yet. In case first thing is very long. As well as like one of those ones that goes all over the map, so I'm not going to bother that. Um, we'll just go up to this location here and see what we can get. Yeah, but getting this game is definitely going to be like a solid purchase for anybody. I mean, if you didn't like them in the past, I completely agree with you, but this is definitely a game to buy. Oh, hold up. Whoa. Oh, so, okay. After Christmas, I should be starting a shout-out Sunday. I could give you a shout-out, you could gain a couple of subs. Yeah, that'd be great, I'd really appreciate it. Um, Whoa. If I like your channel or anything like that, I would do shout out and things like that but um it's not necessarily guaranteed i mean a shout out to your man patrick there he's got a good wee channel now it's sort of like games and movies and things like that which is pretty good so this is one of the missions one of the long missions uh let me see here side quest bex promise so a chance encounter with an ancient and Enigmatic stone circle triggers memories from Vex's past. He sets out to fulfill a forgotten promise to his son. So you find these little stone circles and they relate to constellations and you just have to match them up and uh, they're all over the place. They're like collectibles and things like that. So we'll interact with this one and show you what it's like. 
I definitely prefer, prefer this over Uncharted Lost Legacy. Uh, but I would say that Uncharted 4 is a completely different game compared to this. But I would say this is better than Uncharted 4. But I love Uncharted 4. You know, but don't forget it. They are completely different games. Don't you make me dis disavow Uncharted 4, Patrick. Papa, when you met Mother, how did you know she liked you? My heart lit on fire, of course. Yeah, his heart. He smiled at me. Yeah, his heart lit I on fire. We all know it lit on fire, back. So if a girl likes you, she smiles at you? Yes, tons of missions, some, like unbelievable. There are some things I can explain to you. The stars, how to fight, but this. <laughs> I'm only messing with you as well. You uh, have to ask a goddess. There's loads of main missions, there's loads of side quests, and then there's loads of like side missions and they're like repetitive Uncle. missions. Uh, of see, can I actually even show you right now? Is this in here? Yeah, I got it. Egypt, from the list to yeah, the see the sign changing? The she the That's how you know you're close. Life. Boom. So I'll show you there's like little, there's really interesting side missions I forgot to show you. Which I'll show you after this. Yeah. Well, I think this is the most open that uh, Assassin's Creed has ever gone. Like, Black Flags was a really big open world game, but it was just boring. It was the same shit everywhere you went. Um, but these have got really good, interesting stories. What do you see here? Um, if someone you know, and I don't know if it's just kept to your friends list. Uh, let's see if I can find one. Mm, may not be able to find one because I'm located everywhere. But there's like little blue indicators. Where the fuck is he? Where the frick is it? I'm not gonna be able to find one now. So there's a little collectible, you destroy these pharaoh statues, but I forgot to destroy that one. So there's like missions here to, you know, discover loot and destroy animal lairs and clear out boats um, lift different scrolls and there's like little puzzles here look so each of these here relates to like a location and if you go there you'll get something I haven't bothered to, to try them yet because I think it crosses over with certain uh, hidden areas like the question mark areas but there's like a little kit in this and it's like they're called like the bizarre missions um, I can't. I don't know why it's not showing me them here. It's like right here. Maybe you have to be in the area for it to pop up. But it's like a little camel, and he'll tell you about some sort of a mission that you can go on, and it can give you like a load of coins. It can give you a load of craft materials, or it can give you like really good weapons, or you can just go to him and buy loads of stuff. He's, he's a pretty funny wee character as well. Um, but yeah, there are tons of missions here. Let me see. So there's your main, your side, you've got different events, and then there's obviously the ones you've completed, but there is plenty of replay value. And it's not the same old shit every time. It does, they do sort of change it slightly um, in the side missions, depending on where you are and what uh, locations you're at. Um, she smells you. <laughs> so, yeah, if a girl likes you, she might smell you. You never know. I'm sure the... Sure, like you know, your aroma matters in certain occasions. Um, could have just been his accent. Did you see the new vid of ours? I'm in it. Oh shit! <laughs> I must be in trouble. And I haven't been on YouTube for quite a while. I've missed a few of my own, uh, my own videos that I've subscribed to. Oh yeah, and here's another mission there. So this is like. Avenge French Fry 87. So he must have died at this location in his own game, and the people that killed him are the ones that you actually have to go and kill, and then you kill them and you confirm the kill, and then that's the mission done. So we'll actually we'll go over there for a bit of crack and we'll see what happens. So that's actually like a mission that is created from other players playing the game, which is uh, very unique to this game.
What the what the fuck are you playing? What do you mean what the fuck am I playing? Die, you world. Oh shit, is this the bank hunter? No, he's not the hunter. Yeah, I'll teach you to fuck with me. If anything, we're you're in trouble a lot. That's no surprise, Patrick. I'll have to check it out after this live stream then. Oh, hold up. Activate it from here. Oh. Good thing they did is like a lot of the looting that you do, you can do from your horse, but obviously there's a mission, so you can't really activate it. Okay. Maybe that was the guy there I just killed. Whoa. There's loads of little things that Ubisoft has done in this that are just really useful, and I think this is him dead. Yep. See, there, like, there's a new mission I started, and I already killed him. You know, I mean, that's, that's, I like those little sorts of things. I'll get 250 XP just for doing that. Boom. Right. Go to this location. There we are. One thing I'll mention, Alana, if you're ever getting like a green screen, don't go for the pop-up one that I went for. Go for the one that has like the stands and the clips with the uh, the actual sheet. Um, it'll just be better, I think. There we go. That was quickly found. Look these fuckers here. See the, this here shit? This usually means that they're very, very deadly. <laughs> Zemo, I understand your concerns, but I frankly don't care. Get the statue on the ship and have it delivered on time, or I'll send you to an early afterlife. Lovely. Seems like a nice guy. As soon as I go down here, I know they're going to fucking come after me. Go down, go down, go down, go down, go down. Yeah, they're getting closer, I think. Can I see the statue anywhere? No. Is that it? Not a lot. Crappy bow. Fall out for a crappy bow. I wonder what the deal is. Why are they like this? See, look, see, look how hard it is to kill him. Oh shit, I'm in trouble. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Smoke screen scares me away. I keep hitting that by accident as well. A bit of a pain in the ass. Right, I want to try for a mission right now because I think this is getting a bit boring for everybody. Uh, quests, what are quests? I think we'll do the scarab first. So that's being tracked now. I hate the diving animations in video games, they never get it right. What do you mean? Do you think that look good? No. I think it looks pretty good, but um, it's Ubisoft after all, so there is always going to be a glitch. Right, so where do I have to go here? Ah, over there. Right, so because of the type of game I am, what I do is, if this is the location that I have to get to, what I'll do is I'll specifically enter here and travel all the way up and complete little things on the way there. Because I think that's just more efficient. That's something I always wanted to do back whenever I first played Assassin's Creed was to make videos that were called like the efficient gamer videos where you could get as much done in a game like this in one playthrough instead of having to backtrack all the time. But the crappy thing was, it was very disheartening, is that Ubisoft ended up making it so that you always had to backtrack anyway. Um, so it just became pointless.
everything regarding the water. <laughs> What's this here? Oh shit. Hey, chat. Oh, nice head. Let's see what the fuck's going on here. It's just this stupid location again. Nothing here, though. I've been here already. I was here. This is the other. Fuck it, I'll go up here and see what's up here. Ah, uh, I was here! Oh, didn't see him last time. Dumbass. Idiota! Even the horse is getting uh, pissed off at me. He's like, hurry up! Do some fucking missions, dumbass! There's the big ass pyramids over there. There was a weird thing that happened whenever you met Cleopatra for the first time, which was the mission before this, like the main mission before this. It was like, uh, she says you could sleep with her if you wanted to, but you had to agree to be executed in the morning. I'm never that desperate. <laughs> no, I've got everything there. Come on. Cinematic pan. There, if you can see in the top left, you have to go and uh, go to the uh, brewery in the daytime, but you can actually go to his house depending on what time of the day it is if you want. <laughs> it sounds awesome, right? And she's not that attractive, Patrick. <laughs> I don't know why to do this, but let me see, look, you can hold X. Alright, oh, hang on a minute. To follow the road, and I can press triangle to go to the objective. This is actually going to take me straight to the objective then. Okay. Let's see what happens. I actually haven't tried this before. I thought it was just going to take me on the road regardless. Like just to some random location. Yep, yep, there you go, yep. <laughs> Ubisoft! Cutting edge animation since never. Oh fuck. Okay, so I'm actually discovering a few areas here while I'm doing this, which is pretty good. And another and another one. Look at all the XP I'm getting. Holy shit. But that's because it came from the far end, as well, you know? Oh shit. Oh shit. That's a lot of horses. Rebels. Nah, I'm alright for now, actually. I'm, I'll let you just handle it yourselves. You can do it. Whoops.
There's another location discovered. Oh, this is right at that right? Yeah. Yes. See, he slows down when you go into residential areas as well. It sucks. Oh, we're here. Wow, that's really useful. You try that more often. Hey, I do. I seek the master brewer, Hakuf. I have no time. Speak to one of my overseers if you must. You misunderstand. I am a Magi. Apollodorus sent me. Apollodorus. You do, you do not fuck with me. He sent me for the Scarab, the shadow that darkens size. Please, that is an evil name to speak aloud. Apollodorus yeah, knows the people are suffering. In my position, many confide in me. Trade is strangled, the soldiers run rampant, and the weight of Ptolemy's taxation crushes the breath from us. Come with me. Let us retire where we have a roof overhead. Okay. I like the size of your jugs. A <laughs> little blue icon you can see at the top is probably the wee bizarre mission to the Tanya back. There are many terrible stories about Our the first cutscene. I'm sure Apollodorus told you. Tales of mutilation, disappearances, and folk buried in the desert and left to die. A horrendous fate, trapped in the shimmering sand, your mind and body pounded by the remorseless sun, waiting for the final release into the duat. But these are only <laughs> stories. There Never are real unnecessary. In size. But the scarab, if he exists, it is not safe to speak of him. Hmm. He's a twisted motherfucker. Well, at least you keep it in a secret area that nobody can see. I mean, look at this. How the fuck do you hide this? The frickin' frack. The investigations of Harkov's agents. Concerns of the people. Ah. I mean, this is no different than Siwa. Okay. Bodies in the sand. These are... Can you give me other missions too? A traveler came across Paragada and reported that he came across several corpses buried in the desert with only their skulls visible. Oh, lovely. This is going to get graphic, kids. So, if you're squeamish, don't look so much. So, strange. And night has appeared in the night last year. What the fuck? Oh, shit. Does this pause on me? Probably has. Yes, I'm sorry. I can charge these things properly. Right. So, two minutes here at night last year, they were known in Alexandria as powerful proponents of Cleopatra. Their family were in Sass, but have since fled. Okay. Right. Harbormaster, rumors say local merchants are sheltering him. Well, we're in, we're in good, yeah, I've kept all of them, duh. <laughs> Should be handier if I could see the frickin' stuff on a map to do the closest one first. Oh, you asked me that before. Um, all sorts of music, dude. Uh, I know you and um, Peter like rap and stuff like that. Um, I like you too, Coldplay, Tupac, fucking anything, man. Just as long as it's not shit. I mean, I don't really, I don't like a lot of Justin Bieber stuff, but you know, sadly, some of his latest stuff is a wee bit catchy. You know. 
You should always wear protection, folks, otherwise you'll catch something. The last man who asked questions about the scarab was near beaten to death, with his tongue cut out. Hmm. Who was he? He was beaten to death with his tongue? Father-in-law to the most powerful man in the region. That's a no good. Haka. That boy, Hawab, is his grandson. Hey, you tired of winning? I'm looking for your grandfather. Do you know where he went? No, he left on the road to Camp Piros. He should have been home by now. I'll see if I can find him along the road. There's a ghost. This one did a different mission there. I think I know you basically like grappled to Patrick, you and Peter. I am obviously loon. What does that mean? Oh, line. Oh, hello. Okay, so look at the target. Okay. I was going to make a suggestion there to you guys to ask should I go in all guns blazing or try and do it stealthily? But we all know that as soon as I try stealth, you just got to go tits up anyway. Sure, we'll give it a shot. There's a little uh, beacon that they can light to uh, call for reinforcements. But you can booby trap it so that it explodes. I don't know how the explosion doesn't call reinforcements, but uh, you know. What the hell are you attacking? Okay, I guess it's going to be a headshot for him. Stop you! Right there! Fuck! That was both unfortunate but also good because I was hitting this freaking wood. I didn't register my comment for some reason. Oh, it didn't register. Maybe because you're maybe typing too fast? Or too much? Mm. Oh, for fuck's sake. How did you miss? He dodged that. Oh, in the nuts. Chihuahua. Who the fuck is shooting at me? Okay. Headshot! These guys up here! Didn't have a clue what was going on there. The still sort of don't know what's going on. Yep, see, he just said it. What are we to do with the beggar that Marcos called in the Felakitai's tent? Survive the rain the men gave him. We'll sell him at the harbor for a drachma. Over here, come, brothers. Oh shit. Ooh, that was close. Yes, I'm gonna use the spear now because I wanna see if I can show you this cool little uh, animation. Get rid of this one. No, oh, that's more powerful. So Maybe we will leave it for a second. Delete that one. Take that one. Yeah, let's see if I can show you this animation. I love it. 
Did you know he hey guys, how you doing? Oh, that's a pretty cool one. I haven't seen that one before, but that was still pretty cool. All the blood in this is mad. Kill some hyenas. <laughs> See, you should have cut him down, but you can't. Let's go, fatty. Koopa, I will get you out. Hmm. I think you will survive. <laughs> yes, indeed. I know this scarab took your tongue. We can help each other. That's exactly what I was thinking as well. Whenever I had to uh, kill so many animals in the beginning, I was like, animal rights should probably fucking hate this game. But it's not as if people are that stupid that they're gonna be like, ah, a game where I have to kill animals. I will now go and kill animals in real life. But they'll probably think that. There, there's the wee bizarre guy. He's a little hard ass, he's cool. Shut up. Oh, cool toy, man. Grandfather, are you all right? Is he hurt? Band up, what do you think? Bruised. Fantastic. Dummy. Kid's never going to mind to anything. To him, but he will be alright. Where's your father, Kawa? You must speak of this. Father is away. On his great walk. Mother! Grandfather is hurt. Soldiers mistook him for a beggar again. Father! <laughs> what have you done this time? He was searching for this scarab. I hope he can help me. And in return, I can protect your family. Scarab is nonsense. Everyone knows this. He wants you to read. Oh yeah, he has tongue color. That's right. <laughs> uh, it looks like this scarab is summoning warriors to the city of Letopolis. By the gods, that is where my husband is. But the city swallowed by the desert. How convenient. Scarab's destiny to rebuild it. We're going to join him soon, right, mother? Yes. My husband Tahaka has been slaving there for months. I'm sure he can help you. He knows everyone there. If you go, tell him I can't wait to see him. Yeah, of course I will, Kawab. Kawab. Hen Henya, you've been quiet. Quite silent. That, the noise and background noise this year makes me think the lights up start kind of fucking recorder or something. I hope you're not withdrawing into yourself. I'm sending some of your coveted silica to you that I discovered beneath the top of this. It's not much. Oh, fuck, I'm there. I never thought. Shit, that's the little gangsters got from him. Mm. 
So chess is like a gamble, basically. Contains one random weapon or shield, opens automatically on purchase. Well, bad or not? I don't know. <laughs> Here, the Christmas, the Christmas markets are coming up, man. So you never know. The Magi has returned. In need of more finery? Yes, in a moment. I'm curious, Reda. Where are your parents? Long story, Seni. The Philakitai of Alexandria caught them stealing and boiled them in a bronze bull. By Anubis. I am sorry, Reda. No need. The gods took my family, but gave me my camel, Amun, a great steed. <laughs> I wander the desert and see the sunset when I want to. This is my freedom. I see. As always, you are wise beyond your years. Osiris hears <laughs> not the mourning of the weary hearted. You wanna sell or buy anything, Seni? The future is golden. Okay, I thought he was gonna give me a mission there, but he didn't. Um we're one night. I want to do his side missions first. I should find this Zervos and see what he knows about Sefetu. See if he's connected oh, to so the he's a, He actually is around here, is he? Where the frick is he? Oh, so I just gotta talk to merchants then. There we go. You look like a strapping sword. Looking to improve your armor? Long night? Very. Sorry. What are you interested in? At the moment, I'm looking for Zervos. The harbor master? Of course, uh, Zervus is, uh, away. Away? Yes, uh, he's gone to Lutopolis. Attracted <coughs> by the promise of a new life. Then he is not dead. Dead? Why would you think he was dead? Cause your mama said so. Weird noise, sir. Can I you something? Upgrade, what can I upgrade? See? Why would I upgrade this whenever I end up fucking destroying them? Okay, man, thanks for something, bite. Um, appreciate it. Right position, get it. I'll have to get playing Battlefield with you again soon. Ah, good luck, man. Finest in the area. Same ones the brewery uses for its famous beer. I am just looking. You know about a man named Zervos? Zervos? Anybody else watching? I'll be back, back, gotta go get our dead. beer. The tax collectors ask for too much. It's not worth it. But what can we do? I will not put words between your teeth. But I am going to pack my things and travel to Litopolis. Master Tahaka is building a wonderful place for me. Just... All my family is here. You are lucky to have no wife or children. You can just leave. Right. Uh -huh. Anybody else play this and say to themselves, I really want uh, to watch that Gods of Egypt movie? Looks like a good movie, but um, it's a bit mad. It's no Oscar winning movie, you know, but uh, looks like a lot of fun.
I am just looking. You know yes, about the battle scenes, definitely. No more, Patrick. Huh. I'll Why have to remember to check out your video as well. About him? I have heard he is missing. In hiding? Perhaps dead. What would you do if Sefetu put a price on your head? Ah, I see. I am not one of Sefetu's men. I don't know anything about it. I don't stick my neck out. I have nothing to tell you. Have to cover it on Earth. Finest metal work in size. Aha! Another dude there. Good day for business. Not half bad. What are you looking for today? For Zervos, the harbor master. Do you know where to find him? You are looking for who? Why? I don't know him. I heard he was dead. Why mm -hmm. are you bothering about him? He was a good man. A good man? So you do know him? I don't. I just heard others say it. Leave me be. <laughs> Everyone has a different story about Zervos. I wonder if one of them knows more than they are telling me. I'm still looking for Zervos. I told you already. I don't know anything. Leave me be. Any further word on Zervos? Uh, uh, sorry. Uh, who is that again? <laughs> Another late night. Uh, they are all long these days. I see. Ah, sorry, I, I can't help you. Any metal work Speak you need to done? me! I'm still hunting for Zervos. Hunting? Uh, uh, sorry, I cannot tell you anything. Oh, duh. <gasps> Fuck me, I gotta follow each of them. Alright, so I'm gonna make the time go forward now. Luckily for me, they all end up in the same frickin' place. By order of Sefetu, that old mute was stalking around that. again. Uh, Isn't he from some rich family? Maybe. Maybe that's why no one has chased him out of town. I think he lives up at the Tahaka estate. Thank God they don't notice a big frickin' light bang. We're about to see an orgy here, folks. No one on the streets after dark, by order of Sefetu. Okay. Sorry. You shut up. You're not my real mom. Why do I think they're going to come in here? No. Hmm. Oh, you? How are you keeping? Aha, we're in.
We are not fighting men. You can take the bounty off my head. How they find him? I am not one of Sefetu's men. I'm searching for Zervos on behalf of Hakuf. Good. I am Zervos, mighty harbor master of size. The mighty. Forced to hide mm. on my own docks. Very uh, cocky of you. you. Shit. That dog. He is strangling the whole town. Taxes us to death. He burned my cousin's farm. That's right. Hmm. I've been doing what I can. Helping people hide their imports and exports. What Sefetu does not see, he cannot tax. And he figured it out. His men raided my business and my house. But I hid my records on my felucca. Mm -hmm. If they haven't found my boat yet, they soon will. I'll see what I can do. Now I gotta go destroy the evidence. I presume, or at least pack it up. He's like, you, what's it the frickin' night? Dogs. I would prefer to have it back in one piece. But, if you must destroy it... <laughs> mm, go carefully. We'll see if we can do. men watch the harbor like hawks. I thought maybe they would be alerted there, seeing as I have a frickin' curfew. There's a lot of people. Love this. Oh, That's a pretty cool thing here, though. It's an actual, like, uh... It's almost like a mounted machine gun type thing. But it's for arrows, obviously. So... If I had any brains, I would kill these dudes in the boat here. The boat gets away safely. But I'm going to kill this guy, get that treasure, and then just go and get the boat myself. And not worry about any other assholes. Oh, I might not even need to kill him because he's so far away from me. Oh, shit. You don't see me, you don't see me, you don't see me. You find anything yet? No. That lasted there for us. He keep his papers as well as he did himself. Keep looking. If we find something to hang him on, say Feitu will reward us. And if we don't find anything, then you get to tell Sir Feitu. He won't be pleased, Seraphis knows. Oh shit. We'll be ready for any trouble. Don't worry. Wait a minute. Oh shit. Loody, loody, loody. I could just kill everybody. I thought there were more uh, powerful enemies here, but they must all just be weak dudes. This other boat, to see what happens. Or actually, sh oh, yeah, because it's oil. Let's see if we can get it. Where is it? Ah, fuck it. Thought I could have destroyed it there. Where is it? See how oh, I didn't have an oil one on this. Now I must have to be oil. Uh, oh, the oil on it. 
dumbass. Let's see. This one here has oil. Hmm. I don't know why that happened. Maybe one of my arrows got caught fire. Okay, let's see. Turn around. That's clearly why. Nice one. No, I know that. That'll be good. Yeah, brilliant. <laughs> Class. Bye, bitch. <laughs> ah, no, it's not on fire anymore. Shit. Ah, oh, well, they'll not catch me. Hope they'll get it back safe and sound. Bring it back. Is that it? I got it back. Oh, has to be perfect, does it? Well, at least we got it back to you from saying. See how I'm gonna hit this guy in the head. <laughs> Class. Let's try that more often whenever I'm trying to get the headshots. I'm pretty much a guaranteed kill. You needn't hide any longer. I secured your Feluca. Your documents are safe. You saved my Feluca. Here. Take this as a small token of thanks. 500. You have made things better here. You clearly have people who are willing to help you out, Zervos. Why don't you take on Sefetu? Sefetu is too powerful, too greedy. He knows there is no one strong enough to stop him. We are not fighting men. Sefetu surrounds himself with soldiers. His base at Fort Nikiyu is guarded with Baliste. Fool that I am, I helped him import them. May Amun watch over you. Oh, give me a crappy shield. Still two. I wonder if I can get three. Inventory. What have we got here? Toy papyrus scroll. With a scarab's letter, I should say. Um. Right. It's nice little area there, isn't it? Pretty cool. Let's go back there and do some of the missions at some point. I meant to do them before the live stream actually. So there you see, look. Where was it? I came in here and I've had all this entire area searched like basically automatically because I used the little um automatic uh follow icon. Oh, there's another wee have I done that one? I've done that one already. Just see what no. Right, where to go next? Quest. Let's make your all down here. An iron shorty. Probably got them from one of the guards I killed. Anybody watching, don't be afraid to say hello, have a wee chat, talk about games, whatever you're interested in. I can see you got like a viewer. That's right, singular. <laughs> Smoke over water. Oh, okay, so you go. It shows you how close they are. That's handy. I go this one next. I must deal with Sefetu's archers and Saiz. They are his eyes. 
I don't know how to pet a cat yet. Well, I think it's just a case of hanging around in a location idle and not doing anything. Um, and then you, like, you'll automatically pet them. Oh, just kill some archers, is that it? Shit, I'm out of ammo. Kill two, so just basically kill two archers and that's it. Where was that uh, loot that I'd seen? There is it. I heard another merchant failed to face a fetu. What happened? The firebrand had his sword to slam the man's ship at all. Ka-ching! Nice one, finally got him. Oof, perfect shot. How many have I got? Four. Two more archers somewhere. Oh, there they are over there. It's actually located in front of me now. I don't really need the horse, but I'll just call him anyway. If you have any trouble bringing your crops to market, oh, I'll say. Getting fast, Captain. <laughs> Booyah! I'm scared of Sefetu's eyes. That was an easy bit of XP there. Okay. Uh, I 
I'm most used to selling fish on the western docks. Amosis? Fresh cockles and mussels today. My name is Bayek. I come from Hakuf. We need your help as a friend of Jessica. I'm listening. Since Jessica was killed, Hakuf needs a trusted agent to shepherd people out from under Sepetu's watch. Dead. You and Hakuf are out of touch. Jessica's too tough to be held by Sepetu. She escaped the firebrand. What? Where is she? Back on the river. She took a felucca loaded with supplies to the people she sheltered. She's taken a dangerous route to the southwest past the hippopotamuses to avoid Sefetu's eyes. If you follow the coast, you'll find her. I'm going to start flies time whenever I'm idle for a while. Travel along the southern coast, so I've got to follow and find her, okay. Uh, oh, I got a good few likes on this live stream, which is pretty good. Thanks very much, everybody, for liking. I really, really appreciate it. Seriously, it does means a lot to me. Um, let's see, by an hour, thirty minutes. Origins, origins. Just putting out a wee tweet there. See if I can get any more. Cause nobody talking about. I've got a crack. Somebody, somebody comes on. Right, get myself a wee boat here. I'm in the proximity already. There she is. Quickly find them, and this is awesome. Oh shit, the hippos. Up his ass! <laughs> oh shit. Oh fuck, it's a king! Yeah, let's use this. Barrett seems to kill these guys really quickly. Handy. You know. Get your fat ass over here, boy! No, they're hippos, slow. Okay, this is not going as well as I planned. Gotcha. Get him first. Look at him, the wee fucker, just prancing about. I know you did. Oop, you know you did. Fucker. Ah, <laughs> uh, she's down now. That's good. The little continuity things is a big thing Ubisoft have uh, focused on, I think, in this game, which, you know, it's like the little things that count sort of thing, you know? And uh, I noticed that, and it makes me really appreciate this game more what are you than normal. Bayek. Good to meet you, Bayek. I am Jessica. How did you end up here? 
I got lost. Sailed the wrong way. I would not call avoiding Sefetu's patrols the wrong way. What do you know of Sefetu? Hakuf believed you are dead, but you escaped. He needs you back. Help me get these supplies to my village. There are many depending on me. Yeah, I think 8 o'clock would be the cutoff time. That would have been like a two hour stream, or just over two hours. Um, that means I can have another few beers, watch some TV with the missus, spend some quality time, you know. And watch Sopranos. We're watching the Sopranos together. I've seen it loads of times, uh, both of them, like, not both of me, I've watched it twice. I was sent uh, to him by a man the entire box set, pledge. but she hasn't seen anything, so I, we are I have to get her introduced. Event. Well, Hakuf is a great man. Though Saiz is a region of self-proclaimed great men. But Hakuf has a good heart. He cares for his people One of the things I love about this city. is the whole location, yes. just Egypt. Them Ancient Egypt. Like it's just a cool location to go to, you know? I have smuggled many families like poor Wenis and her son out of Saiz. To keep it's all brand safe. new and very interesting, I think. Tried to refuse to, he has burned to death. You are courageous to protect families that are not your blood. If you say, I hide them in my village until we can arrange a caravan to get them beyond the desert. Hence the food and medicine I bring. How did you survive? Sefetu's soldiers brought me to Fort Nikio where they burned and tortured me. But I spat in their faces. When they thought me broken, I... By the gods, Sefetu has come! Hmm? It looks like. What? Oh, hurry up! Destroy the statue. Some loot here. Oh, you know you did. Is that us getting the hey, where? Hey, how you doing? 
Nice. Bit of a delay, but it's alright. I'm not looting, don't worry. It's only carbon crystal. Where the frick was the other one? Seen the frickin' thing. Was that it? I could have swore third. For fuck. What is it up in the tree or it's up in the tree? It's dumbass. She must need that. That's why it's up there. Mm. Oh my god. Hanging them. See what we can do here. Can we get up there? Oh, for fuck. Classic Assassin's Creed, huh? Well, I know where I'm gonna go there. We be deep, deep, do. Oh shit. He's <laughs> done. So many lives turned to ash. Is anyone left? We need to be quick. <laughs> More will come. Did you hear that? Yes. Gods, you are still alive. I will not leave you here. Ah! Oof. Sneaky bastard. Touched. Please help me bring Pentu. Of course, I will take him. Okay. Get the horse. I'm gonna take my horse. I'm gonna take this horse. My horse is going to be so jealous. Must have to defend this little village, man. Thank you for Pentu's nope. life. That's good. I did nothing that you would not have done. He owes his life to you. This is not the end of it, however. No. Those dogs still hunt for the prick master. I will go to Hakuf. We must find a way to kill Sefetu out of his shell and deal with I him. I cannot bring your people back from Duat, but I will help you avenge your village. Mm hmm. <laughs> Getting some serious XP now. Might just go to this for the sake of fast traveling in the near future. There's some cats. Hello, cats. Can I pet you yet? Oh, my pet! I'm petting him. You are only making it more difficult on yourself. I pet him. Force a trophy. I refuse. No more. They take too much. Where's the trophy? There's a trophy for petting the cat. It's called Stroke the Pussy. Come on! Take what they want, and they leave you to 
Yeah, fuck it. Sometimes trophies do take a while to trigger, so I hope that's what the problem is. I'm gonna assassinate him and then I'm going to, to draw attention, yeah. open our oh, ship. Got you! <laughs> Come on, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him! Kill him! Easy peasy. You're still alive, haha, <laughs> what did I miss? Um, not much, just doing some side missions. I'm eventually going to try and get the Scarab. Might be on for about an hour, 10, 20 minutes, but um, we'll see what happens because it's just getting interesting. Getting a little more XP right now. I don't want to carry him, what am I doing that? Loot this. Give me whatever the frick's under this. Oh, fuck it. This game looks so fun. It's awesome. Whoa! Oh shit. Thanks for the help. Nah, you did. Oh, here's it. Here it is! Yes! Haha! <laughs> That was the animation that was on about. That was so cool. I think it's awesome. Wasn't there one more that I had to get? I'm fully loaded. Yes, I'm locked and loaded. It is an awesome game. Definitely get it. If not to get the God, the God's edition, just get the standard edition. But the God's edition is pretty cool. If you didn't see it. At the beginning, that's the little collector edition you get. You get a bit of a DLC as well, like uh, this here. You get him, the outfit, the, the, the mount, this little cool statue. It comes in an awesome little display box as well. It's in my uh, unboxing video if you want to check it out, but um, definitely worth it. Oh, legendary warrior bow, cool. You get health. You get health. Well, use it, Ryan. Keep it not. No way I could throw that out. Mm mm. That's actually pretty cool. So every time I hit somebody, I get extra health. Get rid of that one. Um. Yeah, is. I don't know if there's a. Uh, it is fun, yeah. Is there multiplayer in this? Oh shit. What the fuck was that? Did I drop something? Yeah. Sorry, my phone thing came off. Remote player. 1080p. Network player, so whatever the fuck that means. It doesn't have like the little multiplayer symbol that it used to have. I don't know whether it does have multiplayer or not. Because the player could. Hmm, something happened here. <laughs> My love, I think your father outdid himself this time. I told you the man had it out for me. This guard post he had made, he had me stationed at is impossibly dangerous. It's probably not wise to light a fire in these bandit infested lands, but it's either that or I'm getting eaten alive by hyenas. My dear Behinu, please try to make him come to his senses and let me come home. Well, as we can tell, <laughs> He did not get a chance to get home, sadly. 
that's all it is with these little side stories that you read about. It's all freaking tragedy. Why is there never like a positive one? Like, hey, I won the lottery, or I got got some ass. <laughs> There's actually one that I didn't show you in this one because when I was playing, there's like these two guys that are playing like a dare game between each other, and whether or not I seen the uh, the very last one before I seen all the other ones, one of the men ends up getting killed. He's like, I dare you to pickpocket a bandit, and then the bandits just kill him. He's like covered in arrows and stuff. I completed that one, didn't I? Yeah, complete that one. So what should I do next? Another quest, side quest, for the for the scarab guy. So these are the little side quests you gotta do in relation to the to find out more about the scarab. I think it's like part of a big mission or uprising type thing. Oh wait a minute, hang on. Who's closest actually? Oh, was there two left? That's good. Go to that one then. Where is he? Over there. I could fast travel. Should I fast travel? Yes, I'll fast travel. Alana, if you're still there, what games are you playing right now? I see I've got three viewers. <laughs> so whether or not it's you or not, I don't know, but... See rebels or civilians in hell, help them out and they will reward you. It is alleged that Cleopatra was the only man that <coughs> couldn't read that one. Hustlers, entrepreneurs, wanderers, seek not your solace here, but let your oh. feet carry you to fabled Letopolis. Letopolis is a dream given form, a new home for you, built by your hands and labor. Where did you hear that? It is not it's without great. its dangers, mm. but the promise of a glorious tomorrow awaits you. Or is it a bow? It is a shining lighthouse of hope. Pretty powerful, actually. Upgrade? No. What the fuck is it? Maybe you can't upgrade it anymore? What the frick happened there? Yeah. Pretty powerful. Did you see the poor crazed wretch trying to talk to Hakuf? He made the strangest sounds. Oh, old Gopa. Is that who that was? See, that's another thing they've kept from Assassin's Creed uh, Black Flag. They're running through the trees. I cannot thank the gods enough for the no. Huh. That was. What one was that? A Brotherhood? No, it wasn't Brotherhood. It was Black Flag. What the fuck happened there? Get off this! I gotta look back at that actually. <laughs> the hell? I know Ubisoft has got a lot of glitches, but at least they're funny. If I can trouble you, Harkov's assistant Nesamun took a delivery of beer down the southern road. He never made it to Yamu. Please, can you find him and make sure he's okay? I am on the case. That beer was meant to honor Sekhmet. If he drank all that beer, he'd be whipped. Uh, he shouldn't be whipped, he should be praised for drinking so much beer. We all know it's true. Come on! These jackals will continue to prey on the good people of this region. I must deal with them.
I was just here for their, uh, probably not going to be alive yet, kill them all. No. See, it was a lion last time, and now it's a fucking jaguar. Now you're definitely on the fire. Yeah, just jump into the fire more. Come on. Got him. Yes. Hey. Oh, that was a woman. Whoops. Are you Nesamun? Are you all right? Thank happy, yes. What happened? I was bringing oh, my delivery to Yamu when I was ambushed by these bastards. And? Yes. Okay, I stopped for a quick nap. But still, the drunkards smashed all the beer and threatened to kill me if I did not brew more for them. Take the oxen back to Saiz. You'll have to prepare a new delivery, I imagine. Try not to stop along the road this time. Mm -hmm. That was a piece of piss. This is like the easiest XP ever. Alana's gone. I'm so disappointed. Um, Secrets of the First Pyramids. Oh, so I've done it all now. Right, so I can... I can go to the uh, the main mission now. You see, I want to upgrade this because in the past, whenever I was doing a side mission that was too high for me, um, I noticed that some of the AI enemies would go after, like in a mission, like you had to protect somebody, they would go after the person you had to protect, and although they wouldn't die, you could sneak up behind them and you could actually try and stab them, and it took a lot of... Uh, took a lot of um, help off them so I prefer to do that for that for that purpose but I do want to upgrade this here quite a bit you know pin unpin so I could go get that right now actually get some hard leather how many of these have we got? I've got three points um, I'll still save it though for a bit let's we'll see what we've got here I want to go on a quest for the main, one of the main missions. It's the scar that I'm going for. Let's see where that takes us. Takes us all the way down here. So we're going to go to this first. And on our way there, on our way there, we're going to look for some hard leather. Okay, no hard leather in the immediate vicinity. I'm going to have to be right back, folks, because I got to go the
Puszka! O się przyjmę do nas. Whoops. Message to self. Stop putting it on the home screen whenever uh, you're live streaming. Because that cuts out the live stream. Well, could have been sitting there with a pet and a cat or something, I don't know. Meh. That's a huge fucking fortress. Interesting. We're stopping off here for a bit. That was good. Uh, you'll do no such thing, son. Or maybe you will. Oh shit. Nah. Games are easy when you have upgrades. Free Hippo loot. Crappy shield is better than the other one. Meh. I ain't gonna bother with that shit right now. Let's see what we got over here. My gear. So a worn shield is better than an anitognus shield. Ranged resistance. Ranged resistance is better. Well, it's the same. I mean, look at that. I mean, only rare. One rarely imagines tools of war as as relatives, but in this case, the name Grandpa seems appropriate. Keep this one, fuck that. Abilities. What was the ability that I wanted to get? Was it this one? You can purchase crafting materials from shops, blacksmiths and weavers, shops, sell different types. I might go for that one. I'm go for that one. Passive, killing enemies with a tool, grants XP tools, flesh decay, poison darts, fire bombs. Flesh decay. Well, I do kill a lot of people with fire and darts, and so I guess I'll open for that one as well. Um, I think that's a good purchase there. Oh. 
You want some? You want some? Whoa, shit, that's a lot of lions. Holy fuck. Whoa. To... Oh, look at them all running now! Ah, I don't like the fire, do you? Fucking pussies. Literally. I don't know if we can get some of them back over here. Fucker. Run back over and fight some of them. Fight all of them. Big guys earlier, whenever you were jumping up on me and sneaking me, weren't you? You fucks. Them lions. I prefer to kill the lions than this dumbass. There they are. Here we go. Where's my buddies? How is that going? Yay! That's scary. Every time I go to loot and I'm still in combat mode, I'll throw that stupid smoke down. Let's see, any more of them around here? I think I got them all. I think that's one of them over there, is it? Yeah, I know there's something valuable underneath here somewhere. I'll go get that in a wee second. Next one. We get the loot there. I spent the better half of the day examining the Horus Watchtower and I have to say that I am very troubled by the lack of rigor that was put into this construction. Someone is bound to get hurt or even killed if nothing is done to solidify the structure. It makes me miss my time working on Chief Nitto of Latopolis. Look for Chief Nitto of Latopolis. At least she had true construction standards. I'll double up the support beams tomorrow just to be sure. And as always, we can presume that this guy is dead. <laughs> oh. 
three, is there? For a guy? Oh, this is where you hung out. Kitchen. Okay, so maybe it is a good idea to upgrade, considering that when you upgrade it is considerably higher, actually. Yes, I've done that one. We'll hit up this fast travel point and then we'll do the mission. Who is in the stream? Somebody watching. Oh, the bunch is. You want some? Ooh, hello. That was literally a screaming hyena right there. Let's see if it does it right. Usually just like a collective loot. Nah, it didn't. I did it once where I hit triangle just once and it took everything. Where am I going here? This way. I could have done to follow the road thing again, but I want to achieve a few things, loot a few things, kill a few things, you know. New location discovered, Latopolis. It looks like. This place must be hell to clean, huh? This really does make him want to either watch God, Gods of Egypt or, uh, what do you call it, Prince of Egypt. Might actually go on bad after I finish up here, maybe watch with the wife. Gods of Egypt, that is, not Prince of Egypt. Let me know if you've ever seen it. I know Gods of Egypt is a bit of a mad old movie, but I think it is pretty good to watch for a bit of fun, you know. It's a pretty impressive little structure here. Well, the environment's pretty cool. Okay. Speak to Tahrik in Lakopolis. Another new location discovered. Temple of Horus. Did I say it was Horus? I guess I said another one. Tahaka. My name is Baik. Icarus, I think I said. I am indeed Tahaka, Grand Planner of Saiz and Steward of Latopolis. I met your family. Your wife sent me here. She said mm -hmm. you might know about the mm -hmm. one called the Scarab. This is not the place to speak. For who your wife sent me after one night of lovemaking. Come inside and I will answer you. Ugh. <laughs> <sighs> Cracking the old elbows. Oh. Yeah, at least he ran that time. Your son is very proud of your work. He misses you. Oh. 
You'll be here soon. I dream of my son and his sons following in my steps. The world is made by great men dreaming big. What do you dream of, Bayek? I do not have the luxury of dreams. Just finding the scarab. The scarab preys upon the weak. It is no threat to me. Are you not afraid of the scarab, Tahaka? Seems after what he did to your father-in-law. What happens to poor Gupa tears me. Whatever my life's work, whatsoever I did to bring that down upon him, I beg the gods for forgive. Master Tahaka! For fuck's sake! Bayek, come fight with me. Sandstorm coming. Here we go. That keening is the voice of the reset you. The desert dogs use the storm as a rallying cry. These reavers use the sandstorm to mask their raids. Ah, stay close to me! Do not let these guys surround you! I will not let you destroy my great work! Over here! Drag of naked yet at your back! They pour out of the storm! <laughs> These three must fly on the wings of the storm! Catching! The loot him? Can I loot him? No, I can't loot him. Ooh, brilliant shot, brilliant shot. Ooh, look at that there, one look. Frickin' four. Yeah, look at that there! I'm definitely not letting this go. Four or five frickin' arrows on fire. Your blood will water the soil of my home. Ooh! Frickin' class! That's epic. No one. You face the greatest yeah. of Egypt. I didn't think you could use her at this point. Come, Fight with Quick, Ooh, ah. them Ooh, ah. Ooh. Oh shit! Oh shit! He's dying. Oh, he's not dead though. Where's my horse?
Bayek, you fell upon them like Sobek's teeth. Bayek, ride with us. These desert dogs have crossed me for the last time. And with your fierce iron, I know we can end their threat. Okay. I understand your thirst for blood, Tahaka. But these bandits are not my concern. Tell me about this scarab before you ride. Is that not the badge of a Medjai that you wear? These reavers are a threat to the good and innocent people of Latopolis. Come with me, Pyek. <clears throat> Once we have returned these curs to the desert they so love. Yes, I will help you, I but tell, you tell me what I need to know, because right. if you die, I'm fucked. But That's why, dumbass. Today. Very strange. Where the missions basically end, but it continues. Where are you? Come on. Come on up here. Come by it. Take up your iron and join us. Brave loyal servants of the Topolis. Oh. We will root these rivers out of their holes and hey. spill their blood it's on the sand. Mm-hmm. Shame I can't reload all the arrows yet. Whoa. Let's go, where are we going? No, I can follow him too. This task you have put yourself to. It seems Wouldn't show me that the last time. <laughs> Only the gods can know that for sure. Perhaps you have been sent by the gods to help me realize my vision. A strong arm. Keen eye, we can restore this land to glory. I have my own great work ahead of me. <laughs> we shall see if I cannot convince you. <sighs> the fuck are these guys doing? Right. They're banging into each other. Where the frick are you going? Where am I going? It said follow him, and it was following him. What the hell? <laughs> I'm here. Hello. Hello. Oh, please don't tell me this is glitched. Has this glitched? It's glitched. Got the head, everybody. Wake up! Whoa. What is going on here? Uh. Right, so it looks as if they were going down here. I presume. Aha! Yes, you came over. Brilliant. Yes, I was right. Going for the uh, silent approach then. This is 
not Sparta! Loot, 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 loot. Who have these cultists caged? Please, no. If you have any decency in your heart, free me. Stay here. Hmm. Sounds like a few bandits are roosting up top. Loot, 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 loot. You, you didn't want the you didn't want anything that I had uh, you know they looted back you know it's okay it's up for grabs is that right? Can't see any of them. Kill them all. Hmm, maybe it did. Well, I didn't. Oops. Flamingo. me hey how you doing my thanks to you bike before you arrived I thought my dream was doomed to die you gave me the strength to hunt down these reapers who are they blood fever followers of Sekhmet the lady of slaughter they wish nothing more than chaos and ruin are they connected to this scarab <laughs> no they think themselves lions but they are no more than carrier eaters and now they will feed. Who does he remind me of? I will bring this priest back to the city. Meet me at my house. We will dine, and I will tell you what you need to know. Ugh. Tell me now. I need to know now. Captain mustn't be here. This is a mission type. How did you end up here? I was kidnapped. See, now I can fast travel. Easy peasy. <laughs> it had to be snakes. As soon as I figure out what this guy needs to tell me, that'll be it for the live stream. This is gonna be a long time before this is over, I'm presuming. I thought to myself, by the time I do a live stream next week, next Sunday, this will probably be completed, but I doubt it. Not unless I'm gonna be all well, these dead bodies. Not unless I play something serious every single day. Cool. Architecture's awesome in Egypt, you know what I mean? I did, yes. Oh, his family's here. Brilliant. Okay, now we watch and we listen. I'm glad you made it safely, Maharat. <laughs> yes, the gods blessed our passage. We saw vultures and a hyena and so much sand. <laughs> Enough sand to fill a lifetime. That is why we need so many to help us with our great work. And what do you promise them, Tahaka? 
parcel of land with a house to call their own. They must only help reclaim it from the desert. That is all? Just dig up your house? It is no simple task. We must all pitch in. Ah! To honor the gods. He reminds me of the king from The Walking Dead. That's what it is. It is good to honor your father, Koa. The savior of Lotopolis. Let us have some honey dates now. And are you all right, Bayer? Are you unwell? I had a feeling that he was going to poison him because he gave him the drink to begin with, do you remember? And then the guy came in and slapped it out of his hands. Yep. We don't know his identity, you see. There we go, we got the scarab. Bastard! I had a feeling that happened, but I thought, nah, maybe not. Hey, we're gonna get free! Of course we're gonna get free. Can't get out. I... Ah... Senu... Aya... Where are you, my love? Yeah, the bird should help, maybe. Can the bird help? I'm failing you. No, the bird cannot help us. Don't. The horse can help us. Yeah! Enough. Good boy. Come over here, you dumbass. Yeah! May the gods smile upon you. <laughs> I gotta kill him now. Now that know that it was straight. I thought he was just gonna give me some information to go and get the scarab, but he is the scarab, so now we have to go and kill that Stripped motherfucker. Armor, weapons and coin. Where to begin? Now, to hurry before the wind erases the tracks. Okay, fast travel. Uh, I'm not going to fast travel for the sake of the, for the sake of the stream. Plus, it'll be uh, a bit more interesting, I think. Fast my bit steel, of dialogue, you know. Then, the scarab. Mhm. Mm Not that many people here. Get rid of here. There are bandits as well, though. Well, no, they are just the bandits. Oh, that was Mine now, bitch. I should have stayed in the shadows. Safitu. Take these arms and armor as payment. 
they'll see the worth of it immediately and return expect considerable service. Kill him. You are dead. That was a long winded kill. Fucking hell, kill that fucker, will you? What the hell is taking him so long? Ah, oh, my favorite kill moment. <laughs> Taking him forever to die for safe. Is there anything here of interest or value? Yes, there is. A looty loot loot. Beautiful kill. I think that's it for here, isn't it? Oh, there's some rebels there. Help them too. I could probably get a quick uh, side mission con uh, completed here just by going over here. Should investigate this. My thanks. What? God bless you. Jesus. That led to like four extra quests. Oh my god. Right, um We're going for this one first though, obviously. Assassinate the scarab. Look like it's gonna be an air attack. It might be too high for him though, so we'll have to see what happens there. We've got enough ammo. Um, we'll... Damn, we got all our ammo now. Yeah, we're good. Want the single arrow here? Attention here. Darn, darn.
didn't know you did. Can I do another assassination over here, do you think? It's too high. Can jump though. Fuck. Why is there no smoke bombs? I'll get the fire going. Confirm the kill. Yes. I thought I was gonna get a cutscene there. This is how a dream dies. Mm -hmm. I could have built something to last an age. And Gupa could have sung stories of your accomplishments. There are things I regret. We all labor for higher powers. We are all enthralled to greater forces. There is no escape. I am but one in the Order of Ancients. Order of Ancients, that's what the name is. This victory will bring you no peace. It is not peace that I seek. It is not for my soul that I walk this path. The Order of Ancients will remember me as the bringer of waters and a builder of cities. Oh, the desert will blow in. And scatter the dream of Letopolis like dust. Bye bye, bitch. That's what I mean when I said about the, the powers that they sort of show. to make him understand if you can. You have brought blood and death to my house. You are blind. He was an asshole. But now you must open your eyes. Your husband was a scarab. He did this. Your father was tortured and scarred by this man. As were so many others. No. It is up to you to the boy into the light. But why the hell didn't the father-in-law say this this whole time for God's sake? Like Father-in-law. I'm sorry, oh. my son. You dumbass. Oh, there's another ghost. We say we're coming out of the animus. Temple of Horus. Good news, Leila. IS DNA has finished sequencing. You can sync with their memories now. They're the, pretty fragmented, the but you should be able to dip in for a little while. I work on your word. Okay. Weird. Is that it? Alright guys, I'm gonna call it a night. Um, thanks very much for watching. It's almost three hours. Usually I try and do them for around about two, but I wanted to get the the, uh, the scarab killed, dead and gone, and get a bit of a ranking up there during the game. Thanks very much for everybody who turned up. Patrick and Alana, thanks very much for commenting. Um, got a good few likes there, so a good few people did watch and like the, the stream. So I really appreciate that as well. Um, thanks very much, and I'll see you in the next live stream. Next Sunday, maybe Friday, you never know. See ya.